Good morning, and welcome to The Easter Chef with your host, Elizabeth Ledford. I'm so glad to see you guys here today. Um, I am in my kitchen right now, and I'm about to make a delicious cake. And as you can see, I have so many ingredients over here. It's going to be so good. And I bet that you are thinking that I'm about to teach you how to make this cake. And I bet your parents are maybe a little nervous because there's about 400 ingredients back here. But I'm actually going to focus on something just a little bit different today for the children's message. I want to show you guys these bowls. Now these bowls are really special to me because they were a gift from my friend Melanie recently. And it was a really thoughtful gift and it made me feel really special. And that got me thinking about something really, really important. Um, the Bible tells us in Proverbs 17, 17, a friend loves at all times and a brother is born for a difficult time. And that's what I wanna to talk to you guys about today. that things have been a little difficult recently. Um, we haven't gotten to see maybe our friends or family as much as we would like to. And I think it's important during this time when we can't maybe be with our friends to still show God's love to our friends and to help one another out in really unique and cool ways. Just like my friend Melanie gave me that awesome gift of those bowls, I'm planning to make this cake with 400 ingredients to give to my friends later on this week. And I was thinking that it could be really cool for us to come up with fun ways for you guys to support your friends during this time. So maybe you're like me and you really, really like to cook. Um, maybe you could make something special for some of your friends and deliver it to them. Or maybe you're someone that's really, really good at art, and maybe you can do a special painting or a drawing for some friends that you know. Or maybe you know some friends who might need help with their yard. Maybe you and your family could go help them clean up their yard um, and do yard work for them. There are all sorts of way, ways we can still show people the love of Jesus during this time, even if we can't be close to them all the time. So what I would like to see from you guys, I'm going to give you guys a special um, assignment this week. Um, and I'm going to encourage you guys to do something nice for your friends. Um, and if you want to get mom or dad or grandma or grandpa to take a picture of you doing that nice thing, you can send it to me at my email address and I will put it on the website so that everybody can see all the awesome things you guys are doing. So I hope you guys will um, take that challenge up this week and use your talents to um, share God's love with other people. Um, I'm gonna go ahead and make this cake with my special bowls from my friend Melanie. Um, and I'm excited to see what you guys do this week. I'll see you later, bye.